put in a couple of slides from yesterday, and probably more by ways of saying thank you to Russell and Jenny for having us. But I guess also the value in, in um, those incidental trials that we might have, what value might come from those. There's actually two different planning dates. really see, I guess, the timeliness of getting all your ducks in a line and, and getting things out there when, when um, earlier in the season. But then we don't actually really know exactly how the season might roll, so things might turn out well for this planning as well. So I guess there's value in hedging your bets sometimes to have staggered planning as well. And we're also very excited because we've had a couple of those ones. <laughs> with my venting and with all the things that I do and there is actually a Darling Downs regenerative group that we need to sort of bring a bit more life into. Forget about the whole COVID who how we'll just all get together in the paddock, we don't have to worry about that then. But the value in um, getting together yesterday and, and you know doing more of that. All of us yarning as Mark said in all different groups about all sorts of different things and then coming together and sharing a bit more of that. But you know to point out too, look at this growth in this paddock. And again, there's just a knock on down, you know, liquid inject at the time of planting. There's no other fertilizers. So you couldn't actually say that there's, you know, growth has been limited there necessarily by a lack of fertilizer. It's just a beautiful colour. So yeah, just by that, I just want to say with a nice sunset photo, thank you very much, Jenny and Russell, for having us yesterday. And um, thank you to everyone for coming.